Hello everybody, it's Minecraft 105 here, and today I have something pretty cool for you. Um, it is dropping blocks in Minecraft, I guess you would call it. Uh, so instead of actually placing them down by right-clicking, you can just throw them on the ground and then they'll just place down. And I've done a couple special things with some of these other blocks. Um, so yeah, grass just drops down. And um, normally I would do a test for command, but I'm getting into scoreboards more now. And uh, they're a lot more useful, so instead of having to do one at a time, you can just spam it, and then they'll all place everywhere. And uh, next is the sign, and when you drop it, it places a sign, and it actually says hello on it, and when you right-click it, it says hello in chat. Now this one's my favorite one, the TNT. You can see I was messing with it. When you throw it down, it blows up. Um, I did a video on this earlier, or once before. But um, it wasn't as good because the TNT lit right as you dropped it. But this time it lands on the ground. And it blows up eventually. <laughs> now this one uh, is actually really annoying because the, the chickens, um, when they lay eggs, they're actually laying ender eggs. Um, <laughs> I think that's really annoying. But yeah, I didn't think about that when I was making it. Rotten Flesh uh, places a zombie, which I think is pretty cool. You could do a bunch. Now, note blocks, if you drop one, it plays a little, like, note, and then it does particles. You can, like, drop these everywhere. XP actually places a XP, uh, well, it just places XP on the ground. So if I s drop this everywhere, you'll see it, there's XP all over there, and I can pick it up. Uh, next is the rail. If I drop it, it places a rail and puts a minecart on top of it. Which is cool. And we have two more. Just get out of there. Oh, three more. So, uh, let's see. You just get those there. The armor stand, when you drop it, priority guest, it places it down. Which is cool. Firework actually blows up like that. It's kind of fun to just run around and do that. Um, torch, and this is the last one. It just places a torch on the ground. I guess that's useful if you're in a area and you want light everywhere you could just run around and drop this down which is cool um, but yeah now I'm gonna go ahead and explain how this works so there they are so I uh, added a scoreboard called uh, what was it called actually PB so for place block and um, it's a dummy scoreboard so you know nothing really special about it but here we're doing Scoreboard player set at E type equals item to place block to 1. And it'll only do that if it's on ground and the item is Minecraft colon grass. So this is only giving the scoreboard or setting the uh, grass item to 1 if it's on the ground. So then what we do is we go execute all players with the score of 1. So that would be if it's on the ground and if it's grass to do set block grass so it sets the block where it is to grass and uh, then we have command blocks down here uh, to kill all that have a score of one and why they're way down here is because even though this is all be filling or all being filled at the same time there's a slight delay so these command blocks are going to be activated before the ones down here so if I put this one at the start and these at the end the item would just be killed before it even gets to place the block so that's why they're down there and um... how do i get two items to do the same thing uh, without adding another scoreboard well what we do is we do the same thing scoreboard player set an item to two this time so we're setting tnt to two if it's on the ground um... and it's tnt and then we're executing uh, all with the score of 2 to summon TNT. So every single block, every single one of these blocks and items have different scoreboards. So, you know, grass is like 1, TNT is 2, a sign is 3. Um, and it's executing those peop the items with different scoreboards to do different things. So that's how there's multiple ones at the same time. But uh, that's pretty much it for this video, and thanks for watching.